Hey kids, it's Becca. I'm coming to you with your children's church lesson today. And I wanted to talk to you today about how much Jesus loves you. Um, as you know, as I've talked to you before, the church every year follows a Bible reading calendar. And this year, we are looking at the fruit of the Spirit. Every month, we have a different month or a different uh, fruit that we focus on. And for March, we're looking at love. You'll um, also, in Pastor Todd's video about his sermon today, he has a video of our children and many of you watching, singing Jesus Loves Me and doing some hand motions. So I hope you enjoy that video from them. But I wanted to tell you a story today about how much Jesus loves us. <clears throat> this is in Matthew 19. One day, some parents had heard that Jesus was coming. They wanted their children to meet Jesus, so they called their children home. They were probably out running around playing with their friends. They washed their faces and combed their hair, made sure their clothes were clean like your parents often do for you when you're leaving the house. Then the families went toward the place where Jesus was. As these families walked closer, they could see that Jesus was busy. He was talking to some grown-ups. But those mothers and fathers really wanted their children to meet Jesus. They took their children's hands, they went in and out around all the people, and soon they were close to Jesus. You've been in big crowds where you're trying to push through and maybe get to see something or see someone. They must have been really happy and excited. But just then, some of Jesus' friends stopped the families, that, and that would have been the disciples. They said, stand back. Jesus is too busy to see children. The children and their mothers and fathers must have felt so sad. They turned and walked away, but wait, they heard Jesus say something. Let the children come to me, Jesus said. Do not send the children away. I love them. I want to see them. Jesus had not wanted his friends to send the children away at all. Jesus' friends must have felt pretty silly. They were surprised that Jesus cared so much about children. Jesus thought that children were just as important as grown-ups. So the children came to Jesus. Some children probably ran up to hug him. Some children may have stood shyly nearby. A few maybe climbed right up into his lap. Jesus put his arms around them. He prayed for each child. The children must have felt very happy, and they knew that Jesus loved them. That's something that I want you to remember as you go through your week, how much Jesus loves you. I know that I'm sure there's been times when you're trying to talk to an adult, maybe your parents or your grandparents or even your teacher, and it might seem like they're too busy to talk to you, but they're, they're not. And I know they want to talk to you, and they love you so much, just like Jesus wanted to take the time to talk to the children on this day to tell them how much he loved them. I want to say a quick prayer for you today, and uh, I hope you have a good rest of your week, and I look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks. If you would, bow your head and close your eyes and pray with me. Dear Jesus, we thank you for loving us. We thank you for each and every child that's watching this video, along with their parents and their families. And Jesus, we thank you for loving everyone, and we love you. In your name we pray. Amen. Okay, I look forward to seeing you in a couple weeks, and I hope you enjoy this lesson. Bye.